What up guys, I haven't made a video in a long time and let me turn the lights on so then you guys can see. Be right back. Okay, so I'm sorry if I'm making a wild card weekend preview too late. I know it's a divisional round. I'll talk about today's game, about the Saints cards game, and if you can hear me, my it's like I'm talking with my nose held in. Um, I'm actually pretty sick right now. Um, I think I have the fever or the flu. I've been coughing a lot, you know, but recently I haven't, so I, um, yeah, so, um, I'm going to talk NFL right now, wild card. I'm watching the Colts Ravens game, but I'm going to talk about the wild card. There were some pretty good games last week. I saw the Jets, um, Bengals, the Ravens, Patriots. I saw practically all the games. I was three for one. Three for one. I picked the Jets, and I'm being honest. I'm not lying. Because if I was lying, I would say I'm four and no. I'm three and one. I picked the Jets the Cowboys and the Ravens to win and the Packers but the Packers lost so I was three for one and the Packers Cardinals game was the last game so I'm like I'm undefeated well I'm gonna count myself as undefeated three and zero right now even though there's only been a game because I don't really care about the Colts Ravens game that's on today and the Vikings Cowboys game that's gonna happen tomorrow <laughs> sorry as a tourney I'm sick uh, for the Jets Chargers, you know, I had a lot of time to think about this. You know, I, you know, Mark Sanchez played great against the Bengals. He threw a TD pass, you know, and he hasn't, you know, thrown an interception since I think the um, Colts game. I'm pretty sure. Um, he played great. He played really good last week, and. It was a well hard fought 24 14 win for the Jets. And the Jets continue on their journey, which they'll play tomorrow against the Chargers. And the team I picked for that game is the Jets. Um, the Jet, uh, you know, I, you know, I, it was really tough. But, you know, I, I really love the Chargers. They finished their season with an 11 game winning streak. And obviously, with the Jets side, they won their last three. Uh, one, one against a different team and two against the same team. Um, there were some rematches. Like last week, there were all of the games were rematches of the regular season, but three of them were rematches of Week 17. Um, Jets, Bengals, Eagles, Cowboys, Packers, Cardinals, and obviously Ravens, Patriots. I was shocked. I was shocked how the Ravens defeated the Patriots. They did it in an orderly manner. They won 33-14. And you know this is okay. So I'm eating cereal. I'm watching. I'm, I was watching the game. My dad and I. Well, my dad's on the couch, and I was eating cereal on the chairs, as you see. And I'm like, then Ray Rice comes out. I'm like, whoa! Oh my God! And he takes it to the house, and I'm like, geez. That is ridiculous, and yeah, so we won that game, and Cowboys did really good as well. 7-7, seven, seven, then, you know, it all went for the worse for Philadelphia, and the Cowboys won that 34-14, and yeah, so, um, and then the Cardinals-Packers game, that was the most points scored in the playoff game. It was well hard fought, well hard fought, and, um, I, I, I didn't argue about who won. Well, I sort of did. But then, you know, I respected the decision. I respected on who won that game. And the Cardinals obviously won that game. And they just put all effort. You know, Neil Rackers missing that field goal. I thought he would definitely get that because, you know, his longest was like 55. I was just like, oh, my God, he's going to get this. And I'm like, jeez. I just closed my eyes. Closed my eyes, covered my ears, and I'm like, I'm not gonna hear it. And then I hear the yelling from my um, dad and my sister that it was me. well. I heard oh, and then my dad was like, dang it, and it was, it was crazy. It was, it was missed. And then it was Carlos Dansby who wins it for the Packers, and it was pretty sweet, but pretty terrible for the Packers. Pretty sweet for the Cardinals. Pretty bad for the Packers. 
pretty good game and I really enjoyed it and today's game um, it, I'm gonna talk through so so oh, I can't say it I'm sorry thoroughly finally thoroughly on the Saints Cardinals game today I knew the Saints would win but I didn't know it would be in something around a shutout like this I am like I know they're gonna win but I know they're not gonna score over I don't know like 35 points and they did that and I am like against the cards you know cards were an easy pretty easy team for them they just ripped them like like they were dinner and I'm like okay so this is what happened I, I was watching this show and uh, I, it was 7 nothing right when I changed the channel uh, it's gonna be a tie ball game Ravens Colts 33 Okay, just go. So it was it was pretty intense. This is my jacket. You see me? A little bit. <laughs> uh, it it was sick. It, you know, it was pretty sweet. Um, uh, you know what's pretty sick? Me. I am I am sick. Not the awesome sick. The sick sick like fever sick. And I am like you know I I have been coughing a lot. This morning, oh well, let's, I gotta keep talking about the Saints Cardinals game in my next video, and, and I'll keep talking about this. And you know, it was seven nothing, and I'm like, Jesus, how is this happening to them? This is like a total like misunderstanding. And then touchdown, I'm like, okay, so in the first quarter, don't get, don't be too too happy that you tied the ball game. <coughs> and um. It was it was pretty and then it w it went Saints way they they got 21 points and then it was Cardinals way for only one way obviously and the Saints were scoring the rest of the points and the margin was 31 points the margin was 31 points against the Patriots the margin was 21 so they obviously excuse me played better today. And the um, score was 45 to 14, and um, the 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 you know it it will be there will be two heck of games heck of a game. Um, the Cowboys Vikings game will be one heck of a game. So the Jets Chargers game. I haven't placed my pick for the Vikings Cowboys game because I don't really care who wins that game. Because I really love the Vikings and I really love the Cowboys as well. But with the Jets Chargers, I'm gonna have to. I'm leaning towards I don't care, but I'm leaning towards I want the Jets to beat the Chargers. So I might go three and one again. So my overall would be six and two. And then next week, I'm hoping to get well. Next week, I'm hoping to go eight and two. If the if if it's the Saints Vikings, I'm gonna lean towards the Vikes. I'm I'm not gonna really care. And if it's the Jets Ravens in the championship, I'm gonna lean towards the Jets all. Well, actually, I'm not gonna really care in the championship, so I'm gonna call myself something and one or something and two. Uh, uh, so in, in the Super Bowl, I predicted that it would be the Jets, not the Jets, the Colts, and And I picked the Saints Colts to go, well, not before the season, but during the season. You know, the Saints Colts are doing so good. I'm like, why don't the two undefeated just battle each other in the Super Bowl? Uh, and obviously, they have been doing that. And on, okay, so, round and 10, I knew, yeah, let me keep talking. I, and yeah, so, I'll tell you later about Madden 10. I'll play maybe around. And yeah, so I gotta say bye for now. I hope you guys are enjoying 2010, and I just smile away.